Welcome back. I want to say that this is my 10th, 10th installment of uh, Tex Murphy, the Pandora Directive. So we're here on day six of 10. <laughs> and we've um, infiltrated Roswell. But unfortunately, there is a field of lasers here which is not quite as appealing as the Field of Dreams from that Kevin Costner movie. All right. Um, let's take a this look. This is probably the control system for the laser field. Laser deactivation sequence code. Oh, boy. Um... I know this game. It's a Unix system. I know this. I know this because uh, I did find a. Um, I did find instructions earlier. I think this is the code. There we go. All right. Um, now what? Um, hold on a second. I think I have some kind of, uh, something or something or other. Uh, crossword. Here we go. Laser field diagram. All right. Um, so what do we have here? Cross the nine sectors shaded in red and form movements that are either horizontal, vertical, or diagonal. Oh boy, you cannot re enter a sector that has been previously crossed to accomplish this place, the deactivator controller in sector something. Okay, so um, apparently. Hold on a second. Apparently, um, why can I never remember how to do this? <laughs> uh, I can never remember how to take screenshots on my computer. I feel like I do this search every few games I play for you. There we go. So I'm going to take a screenshot of this so that I can easily look at it. Um, hold on a second. Desktop. All right, here we go. No, that is a picture of my cat. It is not the thing that I just took a picture of. Um, let's see. Sort. <laughs> I know that this is really good television, guys. Okay. Um, date added. Here we go. All right. I have pulled up this in the form of a screenshot. So I am now going to go back after saving my game. Well, no, why are you saving your game? You already have a saved game that's like right next to this. Okay. So I'm going back to this. This is probably the... Um... So, I'm trying to get the shaded area on that note that I looked at earlier filled in. 
without crossing any square more than once. This is going to be a little tricky, I think. sure what I just did. So wait, if it's blue, can I go through? Apparently. Um, shoot, maybe I should have saved my game. Because maybe if I touch one of the red lasers, I will die. Which would be bad. But I can probably replicate my success fairly easily. Boy, sure is good that, uh, Security felt like the best way to safeguard whatever it is they're hiding in here was to make whoever wanted access to solve a puzzle. Alright, so I think I can save. So far as I know, I probably will not be needing that screenshot I took, so I'll put that away. Okay, so what else is in here? Uh, hold on. There's something on the wall here. It looks like a cable. Electrical wire. That could come in handy. Alright, I now have this power cable. No, there's no visible way to open this from out here. Must have been operated by security personnel inside. You don't I say. Think about this. Well, I have a cable, and I think that I have something I can use that cable on outside. Let's just waltz on through here. controlling this like a champ, aren't I? I remember when I first played, um, uh, what was it, Under a Killing Moon? I had so much trouble controlling. But now I just, I can just waltz right on through these dangerous lasers. No problem at all. Alright. There's a broken wire somewhere. I think it was here. This piece of electrical cable appears to be broken off. Okay. 
Um... Can I just use this power cable? No, this won't work like this. What if I strip it? Now we're talking. And I can use my strip power cable on this. And we got a thingy. Is it repaired now? The connection should be in working order now. Good. Um, so if I remember correctly, there is an on-off switch here. So maybe now I can switch it on. It's a power switch. Must be important being this close to the door. Oh, great. Um... So what, did that open that door that I couldn't get in? Inside... Laser Beam Hall? I guess it could have opened any number of doors. Oh, that door still looks closed. Um... Rather than go all the way through, I think I'm going to check out some other locked doors and see if they manage to do anything. Okay, so... Here... Can I go into this emergency bunker? Ah. Um, X rations? Oh my, there's a trap door on the floor. Or some kind of loose floorboard or something. Dynamite. I wonder if it's any good. Never know when some dynamite might like, come in handy. Um, oh, is this why we have a fuse? Yeah, here we go. So probably we have to blow something up at some point. All right. Well, one thing I could maybe do with this dynamite is um, <laughs> blow up the door to get into uh, what you call it the the one door that I can't get through that I need to get through over here. So let's go over here. And let's go this way. So, oh, I should probably save my game. Save game. There we go. All right. Da -da -da. Touching the red lasers. Go through here. Go through 
here. Gonna do this. Over here. Okay. Alright. So, I have a feeling this could be very dangerous. So I will save my game again. And I'm gonna combine... my match with my dynamite. And I'm gonna use my lit dynamite. I'd better get as far away from here as possible. Not a bad idea. So I'm gonna go this way. Whoop -ba -ba. Whoops. Okay. Let's go. Well, I guess that was not far away enough. As the dynamite detonates, I'm struck by a simultaneous flash of insight, namely PI rule number five, know when to run away. I think I did know when to run away, but I didn't run fast enough. But that's all right. We can always try again. I'd to do. Come on, Tex. Tex Murphy, keep going. Go, go, go. Faster, faster. Whoop a doo doo. Uh, this is where a better control scheme would come in handy. So I survived. That was a large explosion, friends. Not the most subtle way to get behind a locked door, but I guess it works. Um, so we can go through here, right? Seems like I should be able to. I blew it up. There's a nice big gaping hole there. any more dynamite, do I? I don't. So... Did I miss something? 
Oh. <laughs> Alright, I guess I had to open that. Oh great, did I miss something? Hello, what wizard? Um, I got some dynamite and blew up a locked door. And once I went through, I got pelted with some poison gas. This is all in the Roswell military base, of course. And it uh, looks like I've been captured Whoa. or something. What hit me? Must have been a pocket of gas by the door. Um. Oh, so I passed out by the door, but thankfully nobody found me? Cool. Um. I will save the game. Day seven. It's a whole new world to explore down here. Um, so is something down here? Uh -oh. The hair on the back of my neck standing up. Something's headed my way. Something's headed my way. Where is this thing that's headed my way? Hmm. Well. Can't live in a corner, I guess. Dorms, huh? Door won't budge. Is 
storage room, huh? Diesel fuel. I think that's part of a welding torch. Okay, I have a torch handle. So, not sure where this thing but these is. These cases have been empty since 1998. That is apparently coming after me. I had no idea that this game was going to turn into alien isolation. Okay, I think that was the direction I came from. So let's see what's over here. Uh, what is this? Mess hall, huh? These napkin dispensers are about the only things left in the mess hall. entirely sure what I was looking at just then. Is that thing down here with me now, or...? Panda Space Stand says, aliens! Yep. Um... Okay. So I am inside this kitchen. There is nothing in the freezer. Nothing to find here. All right. Um. There is nothing in the refrigerator. Someone left some cookware behind. I guess I'll take this cookware. Ah, another refrigerator, huh? Ah, there's some kind of weapon. I think. An ice pick. Maybe this will help me kill aliens. So, I have no idea where this alien is, and I'm a little concerned that um, it might be on some kind of like timed thing. So 
So I'm going to make multiple saves. Let's see, maybe now that I have this ice pick, I can... Well, that won't work. Won't it? How about a shovel? Storage door looks operational. That doesn't seem to... Oh, wait. That door was already unlocked. Um, this barrel still has some diesel fuel inside. Not sure what just happened. So, can I get... Well, that won't work. Um... I now have a pot of diesel fuel. Alright, I am going to make another save. What wizard says, maybe you can use the ice pick to kill a communist. Uh, maybe. I'm gonna keep making new saves because I am worried that this is a timed event and that if I, um, don't have an earlier save, I might get irreparably screwed. So. Oh, can I take the ice pick back? No. Okay. Alright, dorms. This was a locked door. I am going to try the shovel. This doesn't look good. There's a disc on the ground. That's a disc. What little secrets are recorded on this baby? The weapons don't appear to be in usable condition. Too bad. What wizard says, ah, it's 100 free hours of AOL. Oh boy, look at this, uh, Chairs are scattered everywhere. Looks like everyone was in a panic. That doesn't look good.
All right, is there anything in these lockers? Pan the space stand knows that I love opening lockers. The lockers have sustained a truckload of damage. The lockers have... The walls and pillars have sustained a lot. The lockers have... Okay, I can't open any of the lockers. Wait a minute. Whatever that is, doesn't look like it was purchased at Sears. Hmm. Can't say I know what that is. Um... All right. Panda Space Dan says, Man, I am playing Spelunky, and that piano chord in your game sounds just like the chords that plays when you anger Kali. <laughs> nice. Containment unit. So this is a containment unit, huh? Um... <laughs> feel like I have something. Containment scrap. This scrap refers to some sort of containment chamber with right. instructions on how to open it. Ah, so maybe... Aha! Uh -huh. Well, at least they didn't have to solve a puzzle. The instructions on the scrap of paper from Malloy's warehouse get this contraption open. But what am I supposed to do with it? Oh, I don't know. Maybe trap an alien in there? Okay. Never quite figured out what the story was here. I wonder if I can um, do anything with this, with this containment device in the kitchen. There is a stove here, after all. That doesn't seem to do it. Well, that won't. 
<laughs> um, oh, I can turn this on. This lever controls the front burner pad on the stove. Hmm. Nothing happened. Um. So apparently I am supposed to put, do that. That doesn't seem to. Well. That doesn't seem to. <laughs> well. I'm not sure why I would want to heat up uh, diesel fuel. That doesn't seem to. I'm not sure what I'm doing here. This lever can. Oh, hey, that one works. Ship ba da ba da ba da. Oh, I can heat up the diesel fuel. <laughs> uh, good, I guess. Eating some fuel. I'm I'm starting to get the feeling that this uh, alien thing is like a timed puzzle, and I only have so much time to solve all of this stuff. But um, hopefully I hopefully I'm wrong. Um. I haven't been over here, have I? This is the mess hall. Um, ah, oh, another storage room. <laughs> what wizard says, classic adventure game puzzle, heat fuel on stove. Yep. Case appears to be made of plastic. Plastic case. Uh, when the alien goes back to the kitchen later for a snack, the fuel will explode. That sounds good. Cue credits. <laughs> um, ice stealing torch cutting tip. All right. What else is this here? A box of industrial strength spark plugs. Nice. I will take a spark plug, thank you. Okay. Well, maybe my fuel is hot now. Now that I've cooked up my fuel. I can serve it to the alien. Or maybe this wasn't where I wanted to go. Can 
turned around here. What room? Oh, okay. I was just in there. Um, mess hall. Liquefied fuel. Do I need to turn the burner off now? This lever can. Better safe than sorry. Good thing I have this liquefied fuel now. Elevator, storage room, generator room. Okay, um, Danger, high voltage. Um, so I'm guessing I need to put some fuel in here. Good, you are now full. So... Something's missing from the cylinder head. Is it a spark plug? The description for this button has worn off. Okay. That's got it going. Oh no, I was killed by something. I guess I need to make an addition to the Tex Murphy rules. Don't screw around with an alien entity. As the green mist surrounds me, I'm paralyzed, and moments later, I lose my breath and black out. The entity seems to feed on energy and heat. What was it? It says, ah, when you turned that on, I was sure my game froze, because it sounded just like a frozen game. Alright, so... Let's see. Do I have a... Okay, I'm gonna take this. And do I have my spark plugs? 
It doesn't look like I have my, my spark plugs. So I'm going to go get my spark plugs. And if I'm not able to figure this out in the next couple minutes, I'll probably save it for tomorrow. Um, so I think the spark plugs are in here. But yeah, it was in the plastic case. It is a torch cutting tip. And I have my box of spark plugs. I can go over here. Skip past the alien. Go this way to the generator room. And. All right, so I never really took a good look at this thing. Um, push to close, contact, stored energy. Okay, so maybe... Maybe... I, this is how I access the alien, because it's like stored energy. Spark plugs. That. And get some fuel. Actually, I should probably make a separate save here. This is where I died last time. And... All right. So I'm probably gonna pump this. Prime it, and then let's turn the sucker on. Maybe I'll be able to... Uh... That's got it going. I feel like I am close to doing whatever it is I need to do, but I am not entirely sure how I need... Because, okay, I need to trap the alien in that containment device thing. But I am not entirely sure how to do that. I think it has something to do with that generator that I just turned on. Um, I guess I need to make an addition to the Tex Murphy rules. Don't screw around with an alien entity. As the green mist surrounds me, I'm paralyzed, and moments later, I lose my breath and black out. The entity seems to feed on energy and heat. See, because I'm I turn on this generator. Oh, if I turn maybe I just didn't turn the generator on soon enough. Maybe maybe if I'm quick a little bit quicker about it, um I can turn that generator on and it will go to the generator because that is energy and heat right there, and then I can trap it with my containment device. But um I will Give that a try. I'll probably have to restore an earlier save and just try to do everything a bit faster. Um, 
Panda Space Dan says, hopefully this is not as bad as the end of the Gabriel Knight game where you have to knock the wolf into a furnace by clicking the exact pixel at the exact second. Hopefully not. Um, but in the meantime, I think I'm going to call it quits for tonight. And I will start up with this again on Monday. Um, so I think... Uh, at least I'm hoping that the um, remaining parts of the game are a little reasonable, more reasonable um, in terms of length, the remaining days. So let's see. I, I'm hoping that maybe I can finish up this game next week. Um, if not, I will be kind of sad, but we will get through it. So thanks for watching, and I will be back on Monday.